This week, our website, trinityrosal.com, received a major update with a clean new look and lots of new information that's easy to navigate and find. It also directly incorporates our new school website. Lisa Ancona Roach, our webmaster, has been hard at work on this update for some time. Lisa says she still has work to do on it, but I think it looks great. If you haven't visited trinityroselle.com recently, stop by and browse for a while. If you're a regular user, you'll enjoy the improvements. What I like is that even though it's got a fresh new look, I can still find all the stuff I'm looking for. Let us know what you think. Next Saturday, September 14th, is the Veterans Clinic and Expo here at Trinity from 8.30 a.m. to 2 p.m. And there will be many groups here with health, education, employment, and other resources for veterans, active duty and National Guard personnel, and their families. There will be free flu shots for veterans enrolled in the VA healthcare system. See the insert in your takeout for all the details. Also next week on Saturday, it's our first worship time of 5 o'clock p.m. So remember that, next Saturday service, 5 o'clock p.m. Here's Gail Kabazinski with an update on our children's ministry programs. Hi, we're here to tell you about some programs we have for kids at Trinity. One of them is on Wednesday nights called Pioneer Club, and that starts this Wednesday, September 11th. So you're right on time for that. Another program we have is Kids Church or 930 Sunday School. Both are on Sunday. If you need information on any of these programs, please check out our Trinity website or come to Office 101. That's where you'll find me and my friend here, and we'll help you get started. Hope to see you soon. If you've been considering joining Trinity Congregation, we'd like to invite you for dinner next Sunday, September 15th at 4.30 p.m. in the Family Life Center. Meet our pastors and other congregational leaders. Child care will be provided. Just RSVP to Pam's stores in the church office. Our next round of Body Life Basics classes starts the week of September 16th. Body Life Basics is the blueprint for how we at Trinity intend to live as a Christian community. Everyone is encouraged to take Body Life Basics. You can find the schedule in your takeout and get more information at the Connection Center on your way out of church. Coming up on Friday, September 20th and Saturday the 21st is Oktoberfest 2013. Open from 5 to midnight both nights features great music, great food, and delicious adult beverage. New this year is the teen dance for students from ages 14 through 17. Our next Financial Peace University session begins on Wednesday night, September 25th. This nine-week course meets from 6.30 p.m. to 8.15 p.m. and can really help you get your financial life in order. Dave Ramsey uses scripture, humor, and common sense to teach and motivate you to improve your finances. You can register online using Trinity Connect. Life is not meant to be lived alone. Join one of our new life groups where you can experience real biblical fellowship. We're encouraging everyone at Trinity to get connected in a life group in order to experience contagious Christian community the way God designed it. Here are comments from a couple of people in life groups now. I think just an outlet to, to have personal one-on-one -on -one time with other men in similar situations and even in different situations, just all different age groups, just to learn and to talk about, you know, life and talk about God and talk about faith. Just something that, you know, I was completely lacking from my life before. And just to have uh, an accountability where you're you have these guys there to they have your back. Uh, they're gonna they're gonna help you out during hard times, you're gonna help them out and it's just a, a way to, to talk to people and just to to connect in a completely different way than just going to church every Sunday would ever be able to do for you. We all have challenges in our lives with our families, with our personal lives, and you become comfortable enough with people to share this thing and ask them for prayers. Uh, we've all picked out of a hat and we have a prayer partner now. and. It's really nice to know that you can call this specific person and say, would you please pray for this issue that I have? And then you know that there will be prayer there.